the gate that I'm gonna board my flight to go to Addis Ababa. Mm. You have to take a bus to get there. The airport is so huge. Yeah. A to C. As you can see, I'm now in front of it. Uh, like, I think five to six hours waiting for my transfer to go to Addis Ababa. But yeah, the airport is fine, quiet. But what uh, really shocked me, like you have to walk stairs. I, I don't think uh, with the COVID restriction they are using elevators or escalators that can take, uh, you know, more people who are going to break uh, distanciation, you know. So I had to carry like uh, my hand luggage, with <laughs> like you, you know, you're walking the stairs with this in your hand. So yeah, but surely the the world is opening now. Uh, we're winning against this uh, pandemic, you know. Yeah, we have lost so many people, which is really bad. And uh, traveling at this time as well is not is not good. It's stressing, you know, because you have to go through all those, you know, pandemic restriction and everything, you know, COVID test. And in Europe, if you don't have a, a, a vaccine certificate, you know, um, for me, I've taken three already. Like I've taken the three shots to Pfizer and the booster, you know. Yeah. Just to protect myself and protect other people, you know. Uh, so, yeah, that's traveling. It's so stressing nowadays when you travel. It's so expensive because you have to spend extra uh, money that you're supposed to go and enjoy somewhere on COVID tests, you know. Uh, yeah, and flights uh, are not cheap as they used to be because, uh, like uh, with Ethiopia, for example, like I should get a nice ticket say, in January, uh, you know, Feb. But now I think they've changed. Just like when you're traveling, it's normal at every busy time of the year, you know. And the luggage as well. That's another thing that I'm going to talk about. That's what I say I'm going to talk about. That's why I didn't vlog at the Dublin airport. Because I was so mad and angry as well for what I had to pay, you know for extra luggage. Before you also pay like 150 euro for one bag of 23 kg. But now it's 200 euros. So you can imagine I have to pay for extra luggage uh, for like, you know, five bags. As I told you guys, when I was in the train, I couldn't vlog in um, in the Dublin air because I was so busy with checking in and pushing my luggage. Um, yeah, but also, they made me mad, you know. So, the airline, I'm so shocked. They seem one of the good African airlines that are making us proud. But I just found that my, my, my mind, everything I can since 2016, they just wrote it off. It's like they, they deleted it. 
that they robbed me, you know. And I was accumulating those miles uh, to maybe use them on something or upgrade. But last year they sent us some messages that if we don't uh, use the miles or upgrade on uh, this and that, or buy another ticket, they were going to write them off. And then I was like, every option that they're giving you, they are pushing you to buy a ticket, even though you are not ready to travel. Imagine last year I traveled in January, and I was planning to travel again in January this year. But it, my plan were not, you know, didn't go as, you know, I was thinking, you know. So I get to travel in uh, February, you know. So my mile that I supposed to use maybe to buy uh, extra luggage and stuff were gone. And today I had to pay for my extra luggage. And they are so expensive. And the lady who, that was there wasn't understanding, you know. She couldn't understand. I'm explaining to her that this it's what's supposed to be done, blah, blah, blah. But anyway, this time around, I'm tired of fighting with people, you know. So what I did, I paid for what they asked me to pay for, which is quite uh, a lot of money, money that I was supposed to use on my trip and stuff. So I was uh, just so mad, I couldn't speak. And then I was crashing, I had to check out all the, among the last people to check to check in, you know, to, to, to board, uh, you know, um, which is not good as well because the lady that was there wasn't really helpful. What happened is Ethiopian airline doesn't go to Dublin at the moment, and what they do, they use uh, flights like the, the British Airlines and the South. Most of the time that I come, I always pass here in uh, Germany, Frankfurt, uh, because they use Lufthansa, you know, and then from me, uh, from Germany, I'm going to go, you know, to go to Addis Ababa, you know. Yeah, I'm tired with the luggage. I woke up, you know, I woke up at 3 o'clock in the morning. I had to take... I live in a building. I had to take uh, the luggage from my apartment to the ground floor, you know, and drive to the bus stop, you know, and then unpack everything, pack them in the bus. <laughs> you have like eight bags, you know, you, eight suitcases, you know, eight suitcases. And then from uh, where the bus dropped me at the airport. I had to put them on the trolley, carry them at the checking in section, you know. And then I have to lift them every time they want to measure, they want to position that I have to keep. Um, carrying them, so I'm tired, really. English. Uh, what I love about the uh, airport in other countries so you see in Frankfurt and many other developed country like you find like uh, you have a smoking area or a smoking lounge so that is reserved to smokers you know they, I think there's aeration inside there so it won't cause any uh, alarm to go off you know but also in the movie, you can see me. I'm about to watch as well. You know? I'm just uh, to, 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 uh, I'm gonna occupy it. Uh, so we are in Frankfurt, Germany. Okay. Yeah, it's me again. As I said, I'm so tired. Really, <laughs> so tired. I think.
Jimmy man, Jimmy man uh, with Will Smith and this double, you know. Okay. Okay, I think the sound is very nice now. The sound is balanced. Yeah, I'm in Germany. I was about to go to, to the city because I can't spend like six hours in the airport waiting for my transfer. Uh, but it's a little bit cold outside and windy as well. Uh, so I'm gonna stay inside. Okay. What's going on there? That's great. I got it. The beautiful is taking the jail for a good one, you know? And to distract myself, you know, because I'm going to boom and waiting for six hours, it's not easy. And if I'm something that will uh, occupy my mind, you know? <laughs> okay. Shep, shep. This is noisy. So I'm boarding, I'm going to a deal now. So I'll talk to you when I get there. Are you a passport? Okay, now uh, I'm going to Ethiopia. After a stop in Germany, in Frankfurt. I'm on board. So, I showed you Frankfurt. I'm going to Addis now. Yeah, still have Ethiopian airlines though. The way they treat me today with luggage. 